Hello Pisces, thank you for tuning into my channel. I definitely appreciate all the love and support and I send it right back to you guys. Please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel and leave a comment if this reading resonates. With that being said, let's go ahead and see what messages are coming through for you guys at this time. Spirit of love and light, truth and clarity. What messages do you have for a sign of Pisces? Please and thank you. What are the messages for Pisces at this time? We have two coming out. Okay. You have a commitment coming in. The Empress. <laughs> oh, wow. You have a, you'll have a lot of people competing for your affection, uh, Pisces. But it's like you're fully stepping into your power here. There is someone that you'll find yourself committing to very shortly. This is showing up in your current energy. So if you haven't connected with this person yet, you will be shortly here. But it looks like you have a lot of people competing for your affection. I'm seeing you celebrating, having a good time, getting out on uh, the town with some friends and family. You have big, happy changes coming in, okay? Some of you guys may find yourself like doubting this, uh, these exciting times, these big happy changes that are taking place in your life. You may have concerns that this is too good to be true, but I see you getting over your fears and embracing it. Let's see. What's the current challenge or blockage for some of you guys? may also it doesn't have to be a relationship for everyone because you may also find yourself committing yourself to something new some new activity a job something here that you will find yourself committing to what's the challenge or blockage for some of y'all are just committing yourself to taking very good care of yourself some of y'all are just embracing your independence here challenge or blockage for pisces devil so some sort of toxic attachment was this toxic attachment here page of wands and the hangman i'm getting the toxic attachment pisces is you starting things and not seeing it through it's like you get extremely excited whether it's a person or an activity or a job or a project is something about you starting these you're starting things but you don't see it through i don't know it's almost like you're doubting your ability to do something here to see something all the way through what is the energy coming towards pisces what is the energy coming towards pisces the tower the queen of cups the Knight of Swords, which is, which is good. It's a shift in the energy taking place, which is good to see after the Tower moment. Some sort of false foundation is crumbling apart. It has something to do with your emotions. It's attached to your emotions here. Let me see. Um, Pisces, I'm, I'm getting Beyonce. Remember those walls I feel? Well, baby, they're tumbling down. I didn't even put up a fight. I didn't even make a sound. I don't even know if I'm saying all the words correctly. The tower that's crumbling apart is your guard. This wall that you built up around your heart is crumbling apart. There's someone coming into your life. And as much as you want to fight this off, as much as you want to push this person away, as much as you want to resist this, you're not going to be able to. You're not going to be able to put up a fight. This is someone who's going to be extremely generous towards you, someone who's very kind and caring. You have all of this person's attention. This will never be, this person will never put you in a situation to make you feel uncomfortable. Some of y'all have dated people in the past that will intentionally compliment people right in front of you just to humiliate you, to make you feel insecure about yourself. This person will never put you in that type of situation. This is a divine counter, uh, count. This is a divine partnership that's coming into your life here. There's no coincidence that two of you have met. But I am getting like, you, you're gonna try to put up a fight, but you're not gonna be able to with this person. Let's see. 
What is Pisces being guided to release at this time? What is Pisces being guided to release? Knight of Swords and the Seven of Swords. Quit playing games so that you won't miss out on any opportunities here. They're wanting you to be honest and to take certain situations more serious. Whether it's love, your work, there's something about you. Not saying that you're immature, but there is this need for you to be a little bit more serious about certain things so that you're not missing out on some opportunities here. What is the advice for Pisces at this time? Four of Wands and the Two of Pentacles. Make room for love because it's about to come into your life. Okay, let's see. Let's dive into the other messages. We're going to start off with single Pisces and work our way down to whoever you're crushing on. Okay, messages for single Pisces. Messages for single Pisces. Okay, unlikely things are stuck. Some of y'all are embracing your feminine energy here. Yeah, you're strongly embracing your energy and your feminine energy here. You're you're showing up as your own energy with Pisces here. I don't see things moving forward in your love life until you fall in love with yourself. You embracing who you truly are as a person you find in yourself. I don't see love coming in just yet. I'm seeing a shift in your energy taking place before love. Some of y'all may benefit from doing like yoga, going to some yoga classes. I'm getting, to, is it Tai Chi? Tai Chi, is that where you move really slowly? I don't know why I'm getting that for somebody. Someone would benefit from doing that. Some of y'all may have started doing that. I don't know why I was just getting that for someone. Let's see. Messages regarding the person Pisces is in separation from. Okay, energetic and secretive. They want to move things to the next level. The issue is there's miscommunication here between you and this person. I am getting like in fall, you can expect to hear from this person. Let's see if you guys will overcome this challenge though. Because you guys are going to address this mountain. There's, you know what? <laughs> I'm getting, you guys are like, screw it. You guys are crazy about each other is what I'm getting. Even if you guys wanted, I'm getting, you guys couldn't fight this off if you tried. I do see you and this person coming back together. You and this person are just crazy about each other. You're not going anywhere. You guys make each other extremely happy. So, ain't nothing wrong with it. Okay, messages regarding Pisces who are in a relationship. Messages for the Pisces in a relationship. Okay, death and the fool. Okay, so there's a transformation and a new beginning. I see you releasing yourself of this, Pisces. I see you ending things with this person and releasing this with the fool. The fool is someone who travels slightly. They don't carry the baggage of the past with them into the future. So this is something that you're wanting to put to an end and you're wanting to release it and move forward with your life. Some of you guys will have someone that's very supportive of you during this time. But no, I don't see you saying with this person. I see you leaving them and leaving this alone. Let's see, messages regarding new love for Pisces. New love for Pisces. Okay. Your luck is changing for the better. Alchemy, so you've been manifesting this. You switched up your energy. Some of you guys have tapped into the real magic here. I have somebody who realized, like, if you truly wanted a stable relationship, you needed to learn to stand on your own first. That old version of yourself has died. You're more centered, more balanced, more calmed, more calm, more collected. You're at the perfect place in your life to entertain a relationship because you've learned to stand on your own. You're not afraid to be by yourself anymore. You know who you are. Let's see. Tell me more about new love. Or tell me about new love. Someone who will be very supportive of, 
supportive of you. This person may be a cardinal sign, Cancer, Capricorn, Aries, Libra. Um, this is someone who's going to be bold enough to make the first move. But again, I'm getting that this is a soulmate ener energy. This is someone who will be very supportive of you. They may be in the healthcare energy. If not, they just have a very healing energy about them. This is someone who's extremely patient. They're going to take the time to listen to you. And I mean, attentively listening to you. This person will make you feel truly appreciated. Let's see. Messages regarding the person Pisces is crushing on. Messages regarding the person Pisces is crushing on. Okay. So we have ball and chain. E emotional baggage. I'm getting this person is in an unhappy marriage. There's communication. We have proposals showing up here. But let me see. Communication and being present. Clarify ball and chain. There's deception. Be mindful because I'm I'm getting the third party energy here. But the issue with this. Oh, let me get one more. Let me get one more with public thing you because I'm getting this person is going to have you completely fooled. You wouldn't even see this coming. The crazy part is like the the chemistry between the two of you seems magical, but it's like they're keeping the secret from you and it looks like it may be another person. Yes, I'm getting that this person... I don't know if they just can't like divorce or separate from this person. This person is not willing to let them go. They're very jealous. The thing is, the energy between you and this person seems magical. But there's deception here and it's something that they're attached to. If it's not a person, what is it? Let me see. Yes, they're keeping something from you. They're keeping something from you. Oh, you know what? Because this is the thing. No. Okay, for my Pisces who has a crush on someone, it looks like your person is still, I'm not getting that they're in the relationship with this person. It looks like they're separated from someone here. This is crazy, actually, because it's, it sounds very familiar. But I'm getting that... I'm not getting that they're keeping a secret from you. I'm getting that it's just whoever they're separating themselves from is just making things difficult for this person. I'm actually seeing that there's an engagement coming up here. The thing is, yeah, some of y'all are dealing with the Taurus. This is actually insane. <laughs> this is insane. Pisces, I'm getting a beautiful connection between you and this person. You got waterfall, overflowing abundance, tears of sorrow or joy, release, fulfillment, chasing after something, emotional release. I'm getting forward movement in this connection because I'm getting an engagement here. But it looks like the only thing that's holding you, you guys back from moving forward is a previous connection, whether it's you or the person that you're dealing with Pisces here. But someone is basically saying like, so what? I'm not going to allow this person to hold me back. I'm not going to allow them to stop me from living my life. I actually am getting like a very beautiful connection 
between you and this person. And what I was getting, the, the reason why I wanted to dive deeper into it, because the energy between you and this person, that's why I was concerned whether you were aware of this connection or, connection or not. Because the energy between you and this person is just magical. It's amazing. And then it's like, okay, well, where is this coming from? So my concern was, okay, is this person just, you know, getting your hopes up, but then they're keeping this from you. But I'm not getting that as a secret. It's just they have someone that's trying to make it difficult for them to walk away or to leave something behind. It could be someone that's trying to make a divorce difficult. Someone who continues to stalk someone after they told them they didn't want anything to do with them. I'm getting that they they are just dealing with like a jealous ex, but I don't get that that will be a burden to this connection because the energy between you and this person is again it's magical. I don't see this affecting it. If it has been affecting it with grasshopper here, here which is another sign of a fool, meaning that whatever baggage there may have been that was weighing this connection down, you guys will be able to release it. So. I do see this issue being resolved, but again, I'm not seeing that it's really affecting this connection between you and this person in the first place. I'm going to leave it there. These are the messages that came through for you guys at this time. Please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment if this reading resonates. With that being said, you all take care.